Hello, I'm not a pro at this. This is my first experience. My name is Courtney. And I have a gas leaking into my upper body. It's gone into my face. My doctors do not know where it's coming from. And after so many days, they have decided that I should just go home and steal yet yeah, overnight more gas leaked into my body. And I am very scared. I since I have been in the hospital where I live taking care of an elderly man and that was my job and that's where I lived. All my things were packed up and placed into a storage unit at the bottom hill of where the driveway starts because he, he didn't want me there in fear that I was exposed to the corona. And I have parents who had very little involvement in my life since I've been in the hospital. They don't want me to come around and they don't talk to me. I can't even call them anymore. I was married. I had a husband who left me months ago, which was fine because I just did participate in his drinking lifestyle. I had been taking care of myself and everything until this happened to me. And it's distorted my face. I drive with just a barely a sliver of one eye opened. And the doctors must think that's fine. They know that I have no place to go. They don't have any place to live. And I'm in my car. And I am left with no answers. And it's extremely painful. And even the medication isn't helping. And it gets worse. It will calm down. They'll come back. And, and the gas is settling in different places around my eyes and top of my shoulders. And it's so painful. I feel like I'm paralyzed and unable to move. Because of the pain. I'm very scared. Because they don't know much. And, and they just feel like, I guess, if they have no answers or anything, that I should just go home instead of really helping me. And I had a university hospital. And I never thought that I would be left in my life in a situation where I had nothing. I don't even have change. If I did, it goes in the gas tank. I've lost 20 pounds in three weeks. And I've been through so much. I have no family. I had a daughter I recently lost just three weeks ago. I don't have anyone or a support system. And when I meet somebody, they see my face looking this way. As soon as they find out I'm sick enough to be in the hospital, it's it. They run from me. I just want 
people to don't treat people that way. And that there are people who are very sick, who don't have the corona, but yet they are very sick. And there are people walking around with something wrong that they don't know. And the doctors, and now if they don't get figured out, they just let you go. I have laid several hours shivering from pain. And I have no answers. I have to stop it here. I, I'm doing the best I can to talk and explain this. But the gas seeped in through the night. And it feels as if I'm choking at times. And it bothers me me so much. Everywhere I press, I can feel the gas moving around. It's around one of my ears too. All the sound in it is muffled. <sighs> Thank you if you did take the time to watch this. And God bless you all. all. Thank you.